For our final slice of pot pie paradise, we head to the San Francisco Bay City of Hayward, California. We followed a tasty trail of these saucy doughy delights, from lobster to Reuben to pizza to good old fashioned chicken. But our final destination deserves to be called Pot Pie Paradise more than all the rest because that's their name. Welcome to Pot Pie Paradise and Delhi. I think the best thing about coming here is having them fresh from the oven. I mean, just amazing. This woman has turned an American classic into a gourmet entree. Locals flock to this cozy little pot pie shop to gobble up more than 500 of the savory sensations a week. And it truly is a pot pie paradise with a menu that covers everything fit to fill a crust. But the pie that makes many of those comfort food craving customers happy is Teresia's rich and creamy butternut squash. I ordered the butternut squash pot pie, and it was very good, very good. The butternut squash was the best selling. I roasted the whole butternut squash with the skin on. You peel the skin and uh, let them cool and dice them. And then you roasted also uh, a potato. I picked the Yukon potato. You dice onion, shredded smoked gouda, and also some shredded parmesan. We'll put a little cream, not too much. <laughs> and a salt, paper, a little nutmeg, the edamame, the soybean. The secret is uh, to keep everything cold. This is the secret. So the, the dough will be crispy. So I will take 375, 25 minutes. This is my butternut squash pot pie, ready to eat. This is the butternut squash that I'm eating today. Delicious with edamame and gouda cheese. I'm here, I order the butternut squash pot pie. It's delicious, it's unique, they're beautiful. If you're not in the mood for squash, don't worry. Teresia cooks up 30 different pie flavors every day, including Creole shrimp, broccoli cheddar, and tikka masala. Whatever you want, she's got it. What has she got, 100 different varieties of pies? I don't know. She's making pies from every region of the world, and they're all wonderful. I always try to order uh, a new thing every time. The flavors are so crazy and new and awesome. Like, uh, the lime lamb curry is really good, and I would never have thought to combine any of those flavors and put them in a pie. They're all just delicious. Uh, she has vegan ones, vegetarian ones, dessert pies. Oh, I think last week they had some gluten-free pies. Teresa is really great because she remembers you each time you come back, and she'll give you very special attention. Okay, Sarah, get your pina colada. Thank you. And Russ, you get your peach cobbler, the, oh, the last you. one. The last one? The Ooh, last one. Lucky me. Yes. <laughs> Most people in America know uh, classic American chicken pot pie, but for me, it's too boring. I create from chicken, beef, lamb, vegetarian and vegan, so everyone will be happy. Making people happy has been this Indonesian native's dream since she came to America in 1990. Pot is a comfort food. And I think if you can make people happy with the comfort food, it's a good business. Teresia continues to live the dream of making every day a pot pie paradise. I have to be here between 7 and 7 p.m. So I work seven days a week. There is no break. <laughs> you can see in my pot pies. I enjoy what I'm doing. The only thing better than eating Teresia's pot pies, having her as your mom. The best thing about having Teresa as my mom that you get unlimited pot pie for life. <laughs>